Today I want to show you an even easier way to install the ADSB feeder image on the Raspberry Pi. One of my goals here is to continue to simplify the steps it takes to get started with the ADSB hobby. I've made a few videos already to show the various parts of picking the right hardware, doing the initial install and setup and using the software. So this video is going to be really short. I just want to show you that we were able to eliminate yet another step in the process. So I assume you have a Raspberry Pi and an SD card that you want to use to install an ADSB feeder. Simply download and install the Raspberry Pi imager from the Raspberry website. The link is in the description below. Now open the imager app and click on Choose OS. Scroll down and find Other Specific Purpose OS. Scroll down again and select the ADSB feeder image. Then click on the current version that is shown. Finally, select the SD card that you have inserted into your computer and you can write the image to that card. If you want to connect via Wi-Fi, you can even set this up here in the customization options, but please don't change any other settings. Once the image is written to the SD card, you're good to go and can follow the earlier instructions. Essentially, simply boot the Raspberry Pi, wait a little bit for it to complete the initial setup and then connect to adsb-feeder.local with a web browser and follow the prompts. More details for those steps are in other videos here on this channel, which I'll also link below. I think the integration into the Raspberry Pi imager will make it even easier for people to get started with tracking aircraft around them. I hope you agree and I hope you like this video and look at the other videos on this channel.